Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. It's your favorite Dolphin Danny. I hope everyone's staying safe during this crazy time out there. Um, I mean, you know, there's so much madness going on. <laughs> you know, uh, whatever, uh, you know, what side of the story you're in on. But uh, it's just, yeah, be safe. Hope everyone's staying safe and all that good stuff. So yeah, um, let's check out some toys I got. Yeah, let's do a toy haul during this, during this total craziness. But eh, what can I do? I still am a show off. So it's time to show off the Seacons that I got. Yeah, is that Kraken? That's Kraken. So this is the Generation Select Kraken. This is the packaging. It comes in, I'll be reviewing these figures. And this will be an actual combiner that I put together and actually uh, reviews. Cause yeah, these, these, yeah, these for money. <laughs> After you take off that sleeve, this is the cardboard box they're in. I like these boxes. I actually use them uh, back there with my figures and then I put them on it to level them out and yeah they're just some cool cardboard box Ooh, ah! I won't be taking these guys out of the box but I can open the little box area and there we go with Kraken it's time to get smacking for you crackers that are lacking <laughs> I don't know I just collect it <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, no, there's Kraken in his packaging, you can kind of see him. He's like a manta ray dude. I'm a manta ray or a stingray. So, yeah, that's pretty interesting. Uh, yeah, no, look at the colors, look at the pop, look at the everything. I know it just looks like a blob, but it, yeah, if you can kind of see it. He does look like a bit of a manta ray up here. And this is his wing, and then his other wing is folded under there. And he's a full little manta ray. <laughs> Another one. Next we have Lobclaw. So Lobclaw, he's like a lobster. So there's this little uh, alt mode, lobster mode. And there's him in his robot mode. And the Generation Selects cool packaging. Oh my god, Decepticon insignia. <laughs> and yeah, no, they're cool. Like I said, I like to keep these. I put, I keep these brown ones just to, and put the figures on them. Just to add some oomph, some level. <laughs> But yeah, just Decepticon little box. Couldn't be cuter. And Wowza, you can actually see him pretty good in his uh, alt mode. So yeah, he's a little lobster. Lobclaw. I remember like a Beast Wars figure he reminds me of. But yeah, no, he, wow, he's green. These ones don't have as much pink or any pink on them. Maybe a little in the robot mode or something. But overall, they're mostly like greens and teals. But yeah, no. I need three more of these guys. There's usually five in a combiner, but this time there's six. <laughs> and yeah, you know, that's just more dollars. <laughs> just the detail on these guys and the colors and the combined mode, you know, it's just, yeah, it's something to, you know, witness and have. Uh, you know, like I said, I passed on a G11 back in the day. I'd just like, you know, it was like, did I, it's like, oh, it kind of looks like a mess. You know, I'm a big G1 fan. I still thought it kind of looked like a mess. But yeah, grab these guys now and probably find like a G1 one down the road or something. But yeah, no, loving these guys. I will review it when I have them all together. But yeah, those just came in the mail. So I thought I'd share that with you, just how they look in their packaging. Yeah, it's a tough time for businesses right now. So one of the, I uh, went to the anime shop in town. They're still open a little while ago. So um, yeah, I grabbed this Tifa uh, Final Fantasy figure. Yeah, it's like an action doll. So you want to see there she is on the back. There she is on the side. You can put her in these poses. So yeah, it's a little expensive for a plush. I think on the website it's like $80, $60 American. So it's like $80 Canadian. But yeah, supporting your local anime shop during this crisis, why not? But yeah, um, I'm not the biggest, like, I never played Final Fantasy VII back in the day. My friend would play through it, but I would just watch because, like, it was just too much reading, you know me. Like, I get so confused of, like, my comprehension skills. I just, like, I was like, I'm over it. I want to go play Crash or Medal of Honor or something, but yeah. But I always was a fan of Tifa. Um, yeah, I loved her, like, you know, black hair and red eyes and her little tube top and her outfit as a kid, you know, um, little skirt, red boots, red eyes, you know, she's a character that I looked up to as, you know, when I was a kid or a boy, you know, and as a young little lad, I was like, I want to be like her, but I'll keep that to myself because everyone will think that's weird. <laughs> I I'm happy with this. Like I said, I supported my local anime shop, got this cool little doll. Um, I don't know if I'll open it, you know, it's one of those things where you're like, should I open it? Should I keep it sealed? <laughs> I don't know. Hard to tell these, but <laughs> so yeah, I got this Skylinks G1 Encore reissue. Um, 
Skylinks. So this is the Encore set. They reissued a lot of G1 stuff from the American line. And yeah, these G1, I have to jump on them. They have them on a big bad toy store now and again. So, I mean, look at that. I mean, the, just the battle in the back. The battle in the back with uh, Metroplex and everyone. And yeah, I know, there is his transformation steps. All the stuff he can do these. <laughs> Two bot in one. <laughs> and yeah, I mean, this box is huge. <laughs> but yeah, this box is huge. Like, um, yeah. Ah, these Encore reissues, the thing about them, like, when I first started buying them, I was like, I'm gonna totally open them. And now I'm like, ugh. Yeah, I got my Twin Cast and Sound Blaster over there. And like, I just don't wanna open them. There's something about, like, just having these, you know, maybe I'll get an actual G1 one that's used or something. Because, yeah, these are just too rad. The packaging, like, you never know. I might open it just for fun one day. But right now, I'm just, like, I'm just stoked. I just got it. You know, like I said, it was 22% off on BigBadToyStore.com. So, yes, that's still American. But still, Z's, I paid, like, 100 and something with shipping. So, that's, like, worth it to me. Because, yeah, I've always wanted a Skylinks. My friend in uh, grade six, he had a Skylink, so I've seen a G1 Skylink. So I held the G Link G1 <laughs> Skylinks, and yeah, I know my friend was so cool. He was like the Transformer Master back in the day. He was all mine. And for like hardcore fans, I mean, yeah, it's not pure G1, but it's super close. So, you know, it's not the Puritan pure, but it's close enough. <laughs> but yeah, um, wow, that's pretty crazy. Stoked I got it. Yeah, and just before my work closed down, um, that symbiote, I uh, like build a figure from the Venom wave um, a little while ago. Yeah, you could build uh, this Venom, but this one is kind of looks more like the classic 90s spider on him and like just the pure black and all that. I got this, um, yeah, like I said, right before the work shut down. And yeah, he's a nice figure. I like the head sculpt. Um, yeah, if you want to see me open something like this, let me know down in the comments. You know, um, I don't mind doing some Marvel stuff here and there. Yeah, no, stoked that I got this. I kind of wanted to build the figure, but I wasn't too sold on it just because of the shading it was more gray and stuff but this is the ultimate old school venom and i'm so down for that but yeah super stoked to get that guy um yeah hope everyone's doing well staying safe during this trying time you know um yeah stay indoors do what you can go out when you have to and all that good stuff um yeah take care of yourself everyone share down in the comments share the video talk to me down in the comments i'm really bored <laughs> check out some other stuff podcast is up and so many good things going through some trying times so take care of yourself out there and and, um, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Um, yeah, lots of stuff planned, so take care. And, yeah, love you as always. Bye!